Hey guys, it's Allie. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to another Colors of Hope Crafts ASMR. Today's um, going to be um, a, a, a bit of a t fun ASMR tutorial on how to um, card and blend fiber on a on hand carters. It's um, part two of, you know, from my last video, but this time we're gonna um, be um, doing some uh, blending you know, multiple types of fibers. Um, as you can see, I've got a lot of goodies over here. Uh, all right, um, and um, push back a little bit so that you can see more of the carters. Um, there's, um, before we get into that, I have, I have a couple of exciting announcements for you. First things first, uh, we are going to be uh, moving to a new location. Um, my husband and I just bought a house and we've been renting for the last entire time we've been living together and um, so this will be our first uh, home, first home together that we own, um, and so what that means for you guys is that um, there we won't be having any more harsh white background, um, and, uh, like I've been having in, in most of my videos, um, just because as uh, well you know I'm an artist and. Um, I don't like white backgrounds, and I like to be inspired by color. So, oh, in my next craft room, there will be a different colored background. And, um, personally, my favorite colors are pink, blue, and purple. Um, so... Uh, so we're so I will probably pick one of those colors for my craft room. Um, Leia, what are you doing? Yeah, Leia's in here, here hanging out with me. Um, I've gotten several comments that that people liked her, her um, like having her be in the videos. So right now she's enjoying a bento ball. So. Uh, without further ado, the content. Um, so, um, uh, we started uh, last time uh, carding some, uh, carding some, um, some locks. And I've carded these a little bit more, so, uh, so oh, they're more, uh, 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 more or uh, they're less uh, um, tangled, pulled up. Uh, up. So, oh, I'm just gonna come these through a couple more times, and then. I'm gonna roll them up into a roll egg, and then we can start new locks and card those, and then we'll put goodies into you know, those roll eggs. Sound fun? And then what you do is you put them together and just 
pull them apart aren't like yay. Hey, it works better when I'm not trying to hold them up to a camera. But that's the general idea. And then um, you uh, roll it forward. I know you can't see what I'm doing, but basically you roll it forward from the front to the back. And then you have a nice little uh, tuft of fiber to card with. And now we'll start again. Loading up the the fiber like yay or loading up the carter excuse me By the way, I'm sorry I haven't uploaded in the last few days. I know I try to upload every couple of days for you guys during the pandemic. Um, but hopefully you can understand I've been a little busy. But I have been thinking about you and trying to figure out um, what would be a good video for to do for you guys. And, um, and I thought you guys needed a part two uh, carding, hand carding video. Yeah, carrying the locks can be fun, but it's fun that they also have tend to have some veggie matter in them because I haven't been um, gone through you know, a fiber mill well, to take out out everything and. Um, I mean, I love mine up with a little bit more fiber than some people do, but this is just what tends to work, work for me. very satisfying to to card the locks because you start to see how the colors are blending and even after the first few passes or the first few um, cards over
but it's also satisfying because you um, can look down at your pants and see all this, the uh, stuff that's coming out that you don't really want in, in your finished yarn. Right now, I've got, you can't see it, but I've got grass and veggie matter coming out onto my pants. Because right now, it's mostly little pieces of leaves and, um, and grass, I'm guessing. I've tried cleaning wool and um, and um, doing all this and uh, doing the whole process as um, once it's off, it's shorn off the sheep, um, but I really don't have a good place to be able to. And do it to do the washing effectively. So we just send mom's uh, wool off to a uh, person who processes wool, and oh, she has a sheep. Sanctuary in Tennessee, and um, she and I made a deal that um, she could keep half of the fiber I sent her, or if she uh, processed my wool for me. Okay, now they are, most of the wool has been transferred from one comb to the other. So I'm gonna just grab up what's left. <laughs> and then switch back and start coming through again. Because there's still a little bit of veggie matter in there. Maya, oh yeah, what are you doing?
All right, so um, it's looking like I'm gonna have to create um, a part two video of this one, um, or part three of my a uh, hand carding series. Um, because I'm going to get called away in a minute. Uh, but, um, uh, um, uh, sooner than I thought I was going to. But basically, uh, what I would end up doing, I'm going to end up doing with the um, Firestar. All right, you know I love my Firestar. Um, and other wool, um, wool and fiber is just add it to the, the card. Some little belts of silk. Hey, honey. Yes, honey, I'm doing a video. Okay. Coming it through like you did. And like I did an earlier. See, you're, you're starting to get the. Firestar and the silk on this carter. And uh, we will be uh, um, be um, making more of these in my next video. Um, but, uh, I hope you're enjoying these mini, uh, tutorials. What we're finding out is, um, that it, um, takes a while to, um, to card our locks, um, when they have veggie matter in them. <laughs> but, they're really fun and they make good noises for you tingle heads. Um, and, um, lay in, come on up here and say, and say goodbye to your, your, your doing friends. She doesn't want to, but but she appreciates your love and support, aren't too? Oh, um, but she also likes her toys. Nice. Um. Well, that's it for this video. Um, but I hope you liked it, right? Um, and if you did. Um, hit subscribe and um, if you, you know, want to uh, 
to see more of these is or see how see um what all this stuff looks like when it's all spun up um, you can check out my etsy store color which is uh um www.etsy.com slash shop slash colors of hope crafts <coughs> pardon me Um, um, I hope we're all doing well and um, taking care during this pandemic. Like, I think about you guys often and, and I want you to be safe. Um, take care guys. Bye.